Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls of all ages and genders, welcome back to a brand new episode of Tech on a Cheap. My name is Jeremy Kaiser, and I am unbiased. So today, we are unboxing and reviewing the Ultimate Vlogger Kit. I found this for $40 at Walmart. Link in the description below. And uh, I, was in, I was intrigued. Let's see if I'm impressed. I was definitely intrigued. Because uh, you know, here, here on this channel, it's all about the tech, baby. It's all about that cheap tech, too. You may want to freeze frame and read up on that. So, uh, yeah. Let's get started. Ergonomic design, 360 ball head, prevents camera shake. I'm not expecting much. I'll give it every chance in the world before I knock it. Detachable wireless remote sh for shutter. I'm not going to need that, but I'm sure someone out there will. Includes 50 LED light, which is one of the reasons I bought this. I really bought it for a shotgun mic. Uh, three filter diffusers, the shotgun mic, tripod with remote, bracket, phone and action cam mount. Uh, I, I burned through phone mounts. Phone mounts that hold the camera. I burned through those like they're candy. They're not built that very well. And I use and abuse those. So, I mean, the, the packaging is presentable. Um, I mean, I'm, I, I'm all about reading instructions, but uh, for the sake of time on this video... So we got our mount, we got our stand, and there's the shutter remote. Now here's the shotgun mic. I'm well aware that this thing isn't the top, highest quality known to man, but my thing is, is a really good reason why these companies should keep earphone jacks in their phone instead of trying to cut you're charging you're charging a thousand dollars for phone why are you going to take away features it, it seems to me like you'd want to put a microwave in that bitch to uh get people to buy a phone just to just to cook campbell's soup i i don't know it's just me you want color diffusers and of course your light and the battery that's supposed to go in the microphone that's interesting That's how you put the battery in. I know this because I've already watched the review on other YouTube channels, but uh, this is my channel, baby. I, I've i never seen these batteries. I rarely see batteries of outside of AA, AAA. So I'm really curious as the... It's a lithium battery, too, which I don't... Pretty sure is not rechargeable. Should last a while, though. I guess that's what Amazon's for. I want the audio on my videos to go up in quality, and I uh, have faith in this mic. I've heard the quality of it, and it is not terrible. They make a lot better mics out there, but this is tech on the cheap, baby. And that's how that's done, ladies and gentlemen. And you tighten it down just like that. And this will be the base for the light. Now, I heard this light will, will rock your world, man. It will, it will absolutely blind you, like, right now. Which is fine. The more light, the better. Okay, now I know how she gets out of there. I had to pry it the first time, but I'm pretty sure I'll have it good to go for the rest of it. Wow, that is... That is top-heavy as they come. That's what I get for not reading instructions, people. It, it reminds me of a... It reminds me of the old Transformers toys. From back in my childhood, I'm sitting here trying to... Who wants to read the instructions? I just want to try to figure out how to do them. I don't know, I guess, for a sense of gratification. Okay. And now that I see what's going on. Okay. So I'm going to bring the camera back down and we're going to get a level view. Oh, I mean, it's, it's a pro-ish looking setup. Um... I got another camera stand on the way that uh, I can take this whole top here and uh, add to it. I don't know why that won't tighten down. 
I feel like I'm going to strip the screws because I, I really laid down on that to get her to stay in place. So I, I feel like I'm just going to wreck something. Everything worth doing is worth doing twice. Here's the shutter button. So here's the final setup. I'm recording with the shotgun mic and all. I got the 50 LED light on and uh, I'm going to switch to another camera to take a little tour of this to show you guys the, the get up. I'm, I'm actually enjoying this. I thought that uh, when, I, when I first unboxed it, I was a little bit iffy. Uh, but now that I got it all set up, I got it all running right. Yeah, I feel like I got my money's worth. It's a, it's a nice little, it is a nice little $40 purchase. But yeah, let's take a tour of it, the setup, and I'll sit back down and give you my final verdict. So this thing will blind you. This thing will absolutely give you a sunburn. Uh, circle light in the background is actually really far back there. That's on another stand. But uh, this is the third stand I've got. It's it's not bad. I really dig it. Um, the shotgun mic is about as good as quality as I expected it to be. It ain't high end, but it's uh, it's definitely a plug and play. Uh, with the light. You hold that button in until it shuts off. You hold it in until it turns on. There is a USB port underneath here. Uh, you're going to have to turn this a little bit sideways to reach it. It does have a rechargeable battery inside, so that does help. The remote does not work with my phone. It, my phone is a Samsung Galaxy S, S10 Plus. And uh, when I pair this to the phone, it says... Then it needs an app installed. Bauer does not have an app. I can honestly say I'm not too fond of this. This is where the action cam goes. And But I've got a uh, secondary one. I've got several of these actually. I prefer this style over this. It's really... This one folds. Like So when I go to put the phone on it, it, it folds in really easy. And I'm not too big of a fan of that. Very adjustable. I dig it. Um, I like it quite a bit. Uh, I did buy it just for the mic, really, but it gets the job done. It's it's a nice little get-up for amateurs. Um, if you're just starting into this and you don't know if you want to do this full-time, you don't know much about it, you want something that's simple and easy to go, you can't get more simple than this. But, uh, yeah, let me show you what I plan to do with this. I've already shot one video. Uh back there on that stand. That's what I plan to do with this because tabletop tripods are not necessarily for me. But uh, here's my original stand. I literally took the base of a fan and bought a selfie stick at Dollar Tree and I wrapped, uh, I wrapped electrical tape around it until it stuck and held in place. It ain't stable at all. This thing wiggles like no tomorrow. So I definitely got this for an addition. Uh, I'm working on a multiple camera setup. But anyway, let me stop her here and throw her back here on the stand. And we'll go from there. So this is my final my final setup. I'm sort of using this as a selfie stick. It'll be handy in certain situations, I'm sure. So I'm, I'm going to do a video on this lot by itself. I actually use the cell phone holder down there as a battery. So I run this light off the external battery, and I'm pretty happy with this get up. You talk about giving yourself a suntan. Shotgun mic, the whole nine yards. Baby, I am YouTube ready. Not that I expect to do much. A little shot from the back. And of course I put the camcorder that I've currently got in my hands on the stand as well. I've got it, several attachments for that. And I'll be back with other videos. I've got to review this and the stand itself but this is this is the setup that i'm very very proud of and everybody that watches my videos probably recognizes that background yeah i'm i'm digging it this was a 40 dollar get up i think this was uh a 10 dollar get up the external battery was 10 dollar get up and this was 20 dollars this is not the nicest stand in the world i honestly i can't recommend this to anybody but um it's not going to be used outside the house for me, but it is very, very fragile. But it gets the job done for me. And I'm digging it, guys. So anytime I want a suntan, just step in, step in front of that. 
with all that being said guys this has been my official unboxing and review of the bauer ultimate vlogger kit is it worth 40 dollars? i want to leave that for you to decide it does seem a little bit fragile for me but i am kind of rough with plastic things i cannot answer that for you for me it was worth every dime of the 40 dollars uh the shotgun mic alone because the mics on my camera i had to sometimes push my camera five to ten feet back to get certain shots and, and the mics don't pick up all that well even though they're really good mics the shotgun mic whatever's in front of it up to like 15 feet is going it's going to pick up audio like there's a mic on me make your own decisions i'll leave the link in the description below or you can get one for yourself my name is jeremy kaiser and i am unbiased